with my hat today. <laughs> That's my cue to start the race. Okay, racers, fasten your seatbelts and strap on your helmets. Ready, set, go! Considering I usually get car sick. Put the pedal to the metal, Ella. Fuzzy Snoodle, that's our top speed. Activate the secret weapon. Activating the turbo thruster. Yay! The wind is pushing us faster. They're working. Go, Ella, go. Look out, Ada. Play. Maybe someone will find my hat. Eventually. Let's go back to the theater. Uh. Wait. Stop. I know where your hat is. You do? The wind didn't blow your hat into the ocean. There it is. Up there. My hat! Come on back, your hat! Wow! Neat! <laughs> Way to go, Tiki! You found it in the nick of time! Actually, I saw it when we first got here, but I, I didn't tell you. I just didn't want to go back to the theater yet. I'm so nervous I have butterflies. Butterflies? In this wind? <laughs> Doubt it. She means in her tummy. She's nervous. Tiki, did you want us to keep searching for the hat so we wouldn't make it back in time for the play? That was the plan. I just don't think I can do it. But I thought you said you knew all your lines. I do. But I don't think I can get up in front of all those people. Please, you'll be amazing. Not as amazing as me, but no one is. Ahem. <clears throat> what Belinda is trying to say, Tiki, is if you're nervous about acting in front of everyone, just look for us in the audience and pretend you're just pretending with your friends. I can do that. We pretend all the time. Yep, just like that. Oh, no! The play starts in a few minutes! Then we better get going. Let's yeah. go! Um, Tiki, you're not going anywhere. <gasps> My tire's flat. Crumbs. Hmm. I know! Would you be if you didn't have your own chauffeur? That's French for driver. Come on, Tiki, hop in! Here we go, fair oh, lady! Yeah. Hmm. I wonder why that seagull kept swooping down into the grass before it took my mom's earring. Hey, 
Look what I found. It's a real seashell. Wait, maybe it took your mom's earring because it looked like its favorite shell. You're right, Frankie. I know what we can do. Get it. it looks just like a bird. I get it. Great thinking. Whoa, the seagull's following your hat, Ella. Awesome. Let's keep our fingers crossed. I see it, but I still don't believe it. We don't believe it either. Let's see what happens when he sees the shell. Look, he dropped the earring. Quick, get it. Everyone, I knew we could get Mom's earring back. Yay! Awesome. Way to go! Presenting the one and only Belinda Blue in Banana Ballet. Belinda dropped a banana. I don't think she sees it. Oh no! She's heading right for it. What am I gonna do? Imagine what's wrong. This could take some time. There must be something we can do. Well, I could radio for a tugboat to take us home, but that would take a long, long time. Then we'll miss open house for sure. Oh boy, my little buttercup Belinda does not like it when I break a promise. Captain, why don't you just put up a sail? Well, Mr. Mayor, this isn't a sailboat, so it doesn't have a sail. But what if it did, Dad? Would the power of the wind be able to take us home? Well, even with a strong wind like this, we'd need a pretty large sail to move a ship this big back home. I guess we're going to miss open house after all. 
I feel so bad that we couldn't get you back to Belinda, Mr. Mayor. It's all right, Ella. A sail! Great idea, Ella. But I'm afraid it's a little small. Not for long. Mr. Mayor, grab a corner. Dad, you take the top. Okay, let's spread it out until you think it's big enough, Dad. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite a hat you've got there, Ella. It sure is, Mr. Mayor. There, that should do it. Now, I'll just raise this sail up the mast. Here it goes. Yes! Look, Dad, it's working. It's wind power. <laughs> it sure is, Ella. We should be back before you know it. Open house, here we come. Dad, can I sound the horn? Sure thing, Ella, Bo, Bella. Let everyone know we're on our way. Everywhere. Borrowed again, Ella? Oh, Cheeky, you're right. Hey, that's it! A turtle! That's how we can get our stuff back. But how would a turtle help get the helicopter? Their shells would protect them from the thorns as they crawled under the bushes. Come on, Ella! What are you gonna do? Turn yourself into a turtle? Well, sort of. <laughs> my soccer ball. And my tiara! No problem. Okay, maybe we couldn't play beautiful music with the conch shells, but I know we can make a loud, ugly noise. Just like the sound of a foghorn. You're going to need someone that blows pretty hard to make that kind of sound, Della. Or something. <laughs> uses that for the fireplace. It's called a bellows. Okay, guys, squeeze! It doesn't look like they heard that. They didn't sound their horn or blink their lights. One more time, kids. Hey, maybe this could be the new seashell serenade. You hear that? 
the ships are answering back. <laughs> That's music to my ears. Are they safe, Captain Kelp? They are now. <laughs> Thank you, kids. <laughs> you just saved those ships and our homecoming celebration. Yay! I thought for sure she'd be back here at Tiki's house. But I don't see her anywhere. Look! There she is! Great holy mammoth! That's so high up! Lola, come down from there! She must be looking for Tiki! I just might have the next best thing. This is why Tiki gave us her picture, remember? In case Lola misses her. Lola! Look! It's Tiki in the picture! Look! <laughs> come on down, and we'll give you the picture! <laughs> Don't worry, Lola. You'll be okay. Just come down slowly. You can do it, Lola. You're a monkey. It's what you do. <laughs> Great. She's stuck up there. <laughs> what are we going to do now? Hey, I know. We could call the fire department and use their ladder. But Tiki will be home any minute, and that could take all day. No. I promised Tiki I'd look after Lola, and I'm going to see this through. Hmm. How can I get Lola down safely? I know! I've got an idea, I'll sing it loud and clear. Everything I need is right between my ears. Magic hat, here we go! Ooh, a giant air cushion! Okay, Lola, jump onto the giant air cushion. It's okay. You can do it. You're a monkey. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Von Mastodon. How's your movie coming along? I've got lots of wonderful action, but my movie's still missing the big moment. Oh, Mr. Von Mastodon. you Hmm. I'm ready for my close-up. Presenting Belinda Blue's Dance of the Sugar Plums. la dee da dee da dum dee dum dee dum da da la dee dee da dee da dum dee dum dee dum dum da Oh, no, you don't! This is my big break! <gasps> Shoo! Shoo! Oh, gimme! That's my sugar plums! Seagulls? I know I said no seagulls, but... This is fantastic! Oh! Whoa! Ah! Alita! Whoa! Watch out! Oh. Ah! I've got to do something! This is big, big, I tell you! You were great. Why, thank you. This is what I call a big moment. Success! People will be lining up around the block to see this. Ooh, when can I see myself? When I show it for the first time at my gigantic Max von Mastodon movie premiere! That girl is fantastic! My first movie 